Welcome back everybody, Drew Cautions again. Today we are going to be starting a new series on Oxygen Not Included, the Spaced Out DLC. It has been a very long time since I've played this game on the channel. It was actually the first game that I played. Uh, and I'm going to be starting a new game on uh, survival in the Spaced Out format. So basically, <laughs> hi Squeaky. So basically a bunch of, uh, a series of smaller asteroids. And we, the one we start on is relatively small as well. And I've got a seed for one that I like the first initial looks up. There's some uh, nice potential space. And uh, I think we found, I found a gas, not I think, I know I found a gas, natural gas geyser, and a, it was either a salt geyser or brine something or other. Fairly close to where I was, didn't have to explore too far. Didn't go very far into it, but uh, I'm going to be recording on this seed. Hopefully it'll turn out to be a fun one without too many... Uh, crazy death traps waiting for me. I've already got uh, very minimal skill left over from the first time I played, uh, so hopefully we'll be able to do something with it. Um, now you get to choose something I didn't have before, but you get to choose your uh, starting styles of duplicates. So did I do that right? Hold on. Builder, digger, and scientist. Let's get on the roll. Uh, there we go. So I'm going to look for some that are like exclusively on that skill that are really good at it. Let's see. Nine with germ. Oh, this is a good choice. Uh, increased germ resistance, which is awesome. Uh, increased food morale, so a little bonus from uh, lame food. Basically, he's terrible in the kitchen, so you'll take anything that you'll, meet, you'll cook for him. Uh, very bad at cooking. That's all right. Our scientist does not need to be a cooker. Our cooker. Uh, excavation with some increased construction. Gastrophobia. Cannot cook at all. That's not a bad thing, but uh, let's see if we can get higher. Increased now does this does this skill leveling increase all skills or just the science skill? I'm guessing it's just the science skill, but doesn't it wanted lights for that one. Um increased calories. Okay, that's expensive, but eleven digging is pretty good. Decreased air consumption. Might stick with that. Let's find, oops, a good constructor, good early morning, and farts frequently. Well, I don't like gas around the chamber, so maybe not. Decreased germ resistance. Let's find a good, oops, I missed. Too fast in the clicking. Um, green thumb, increased agriculture. Again, terrible at cooking. I think we got, a, we got a set here. Nails, Nicola, and Frankie. Let's do this. What kind of asteroid are we going for? Uh, festering friends. Let's do it. <laughs> that sounds like a great name. Uh, so these three are going to be on an asteroid that we're going to have to uh, start by patiently uh, making place for everybody, for them and their friends in the future to live. we we'll start by digging out the left here while we talk. Um, so space-wise, I know there is a natural gas uh, geyser somewhere over there, and there's a icy slush brine something or other up there. That's not bad. Uh, is that? Oh, no, it's vacuum. We got a bunch of uh, lightning bolts, lightning bugs around here, including one there. We got some water reservoir down here. I think we'll make our water reservoir over this way. Um, we'll use this water first. There's some crappy uh, polluted water down here. Well, not crappy, good polluted water down here. Uh, this is a lot of coal, igneous rock. Temperature-wise, this bottom is pretty, pretty thin, but we get pretty wide access to a lot over here. Like it goes pretty far, so. I think this will work. I think we'll build our like bedrooms and uh, this can be a uh, park nature reserve space. If we click on the rooms here, we can make a park and nature reserve out of this. And then we'd want barracks probably above here, a latrine down here, or a mess hall I guess down here, and then a latrine at the bottom with some oxygen generation maybe at the very bottom to let it trickle up through. Eh, sounds okay. Let's get Let's get on that. Um, I want a, a column of space in the middle, but I think we're going to do like five wide. Let's see how much space do we have here on the temperature. Let's let them slowly go away. So if I make like this and on this level, if we did 16, that would be the size of the room. So if we had two for doors, okay, so one more tile to the other side or we use all that. Hmm. Let's see, 18 would give us a door, a wall on each side, and that would not cut into the nasty. And then this could be similarly chomped up, and we could do an 18 here for a bedroom, 18 there for a bedroom. I guess this one's going to be the latrine. It's going to go into the hot zone a little bit, like that. Okay, and then we'll just put ladders 
uh, in between everything else. For now, and let them use the ladders to drop all the crap to the bottom. That might be okay. And then another whatever room up here, maybe an access point to the west. I know we gotta go there eventually. That sounds okay there. Maybe we'll dig an extra two tiles up here to get access to that stuff. Okay, so then our our stairwell. Okay, hold on a second. If we do, I want a five wide stair. So maybe we do one more tile the full width here. A little bit of warmth cutting uh, cutting a little bit into the warmth isn't that bad. That'll do. And then. Uh, Dig these bottom two out, put ladders in between. I don't know if we got enough material for that, but that no no point in putting well, I guess. Yeah, no point in putting ladders underneath. Oops. Ran out of ladder space, materials. I let them go and uh, do that. One more row down there. Let's uh pick, pick up the pace here. And what I'm gonna do is actually get them to go up here. So let's go ahead with uh, they found some metal, that's lovely. Can you find some raw materials, guys? Apparently none of that is rock. Sand and dirt and stuff. Okay, that's fine. There we go. I want a ladder that's going to go... Because I did one extra tile there, so we'll have... This is the three column wide, and then two on either side... Or one on either side. That'll work. Now, let's go up here. And we will dig... With a nine priority this entire column first. Oh, like that. Alright, let's do that. As you guys dig some stuff out, I'll put more ladders up here. Is that oxalate? Let's, clean, let's leave that one out of the picture. Okay, so this room will be our nature preserve. I don't know why I did that first, but I'm gonna, I want to cut it all out entirely. So, for survival sakes, we're going to put in a, an outhouse here. Tell them to do that first. Uh, let's look at the schedules. I'm going to add two new schedules. We're going to change them up just a little for now. I'm going to do a two down times, two bed times. They'll get into bed, and as soon as they're in bed, they'll be fine. Um, they'll sleep as long as they need to. Accordingly to their stamina. Something like that. That's uh, Let's have a look at it. That'll be three separate schedules. We'll wait till they get past, at least past here. And I'll switch up the schedules. Uh, so we have a builder that should build first. We have a digger that should dig first. Uh, and we have a researcher who sur should research first. After that, it doesn't really matter. Builder and Digger will do pretty much everything. Well, the others uh, do all the research. Let's go like that. To let them pass there. And that. All the way up here. Good. And then I just basically want you guys to dig top right. Like that. Uh, there's a lot of plants around the area. Let's keep setting up important things like this. And this they can use, all that they can use, this. Um, I don't want them to take out this uh, plant there, but we'll take these because they'll regrow. Won't take the briar uh, thistle or what is this, muckroot. They can stay in there as a memorial plant. The rest of that is kind of, hello, Dreklet. Nice, a Dreko. Um, we'll let them keep on that. I, oops, on the priority there. There we go. So these are nine. This is like, do this first, then do this. Yeah, I use nines a lot in my priori prioritizer. I just have to, I just have to live with it. Forgive me or not, it's how I play. <laughs> uh, we'll take this out as well when you're cleared, when you're done making a big mess, boys. Thank you. What I do like to do is, uh, do like about this is that if we dig this top stuff out first, what we're gonna end up doing is having a space that gives. I didn't put my timer on. I want to make these about 45 minutes. So, uh, somewhere in that 40 to 45 minute marker. Oh, everybody's stopping for food. No, 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 no. Stop that. Stop that. Stop being so silly, you silly program. Uh, we'll let them do that in one second. I apologize. I oops. Making noises on the computer in the background. Is that better? Is it making the noises now? It's not. Okay, good. Let's get back to it. So I want them off this schedule, or some of them off this schedule. Nobody uh, has a night or day preference, so it really doesn't matter. Uh, Nails, you'll uh, ladies first. You'll get the first. Uh, oops, you'll get the first dibs at uh, um, at sleeping and potty breaks and all that jazz. Uh, we are gonna need a bed, so let's say we put it. Uh, this is gonna be a bedroom. Sure, 
let's go ahead and put two tiles. Come on, two tiles in there, and a bed in here, and they'll just uh, all share. They'll swap through that bed in priority order. All right, I need this to like be done before she hits her bed. Pack, so let's go, guys. Nails, nails. What's going on? Oh. Because that's prioritized, you're off your schedule? Is that what's going on? Oh, that's not great, girl. Um, let's just make it nines, then. Does that pull her off her schedule? Shouldn't you be going to, you know, use the loo? Nope. Nice, guys. Nice. Those are eights, not nines. Okay, apparently they really love that. Um, I will make it priority. I will make it urgent. Because they, per he's got a Nicola's got a preference on um, on digging, so he'll ignore the nines of another topic. And you, uh, we just assign this to nails, and you'll go get it. Good. Hopefully you get back. Yeah. Good. Okay. So she made it into bed just before the end of her shift, which means she should stay there until she got a little bit of sore back. It's too bad. Uh, she should stay there until her stamina's up. I lied. Apparently she won't. Was it low? Where's your stamina? Oh, it is at 100%. She just... Um, she sleeps well. I don't know. Maybe. All right. All that's cleared now. So the, all of this is now available. Uh, Food-wise, we want to make sure that they pri super prioritize that. Now, I don't know why she didn't get something to eat or use the bathroom, but maybe... Uh, maybe that's not something... Oh, it's, that's not set to priority. Uh, that's not great. I overdid it on those priorities before they... Oh, that's right. I normally have life support and toggling at very high, so everybody prioritizes those. And life support includes this. So this errand, if I click here, this would be relieve self, downtime, use toilet. It doesn't show me what the job for setting it up is, does it? You should be delivering dirt to that. Should... Oh, you didn't. Ah, <laughs> I see. This is a three-way, a three-tile high. They can't get through that. That's the problem. Oops. Go use the loo, guys. Nails is like, dang, I've been waiting all day, dude. Don't leave a girl waiting here. All right, that's fine. We got it sorted. And that ox light's gone, so I can remove the rest of these. Wonderful. Okay, so a little bit of a kerfuffle as I remember how the controls work. Um, all that's done. Let's tell them the next step is going to be this set. So keep your work your way down, please. What happens is all the junk, you see how it falls right through? It'll fall right through and they can work all the way across it. That's awesome. Now, uh, oh, it's Nicola's turn. So we need to give Nicola the bed now. Sorry, bud. A little bit of micromanaging until we get this cleared out. They should uh, finish it up by the end of... Before cycle three, I think they should have it done. That's all right. Doing effective work, folks. Doing effective work. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe not. Uh, next person in line is going to be Frankie. It's odd that they're leaving that tile, even though it's all sevens. Nicola, he barely looks at the thing and it explodes. You're amazing. Keep it up. <laughs> uh, the videos, if you haven't seen the uh, tutorial videos, it's kind of like the one guy in the tutorial video for digging. He just, he finds out he can dig with this blaster in this back pocket that he never knew he had, and he just blasts the crap out of everything. He goes ballistic on it. It's fantastic. Uh, over on this side, I want to leave these shine bugs... Uh, uh, in the area. So what I'm going to do is actually take a door and I'll put it in... Well, I won't put it over the office line. I'll put it there. And then we'll take that. Take these tiles and that out of here. Good. I can actually tell them, do that first. Get that cleared so we can have access to that with food. Uh, we'll also clear up this. This muck roots doesn't move. Well, no, that, that one... That can stay there. There we go. We'll do those. Good. Clear that out and build a door. That's just doors there to keep the bugs in. So they'll just hang out in there and keep these uh, bristle blossoms growing and stay out of my bed areas. 
Unfortunately, one of them already ran in here. When we get this finished, if we close off the bedroom... Uh-oh, uh-oh. Frankie, I'm so sorry. I didn't assign you that bed. Sorry, dude. You're gonna have to make you get up, though, for your own good. It's gotta be too painful. No, no kidding. Sorry, dude, I'm sorry. Forgot. Uh, oh, they already cleared out all this... Okay, Every... all this, guys, let's go. Do that. Don't, don't touch any of the bottom stuff. There's no point because everything has to fall down to the bottom anyways. Alright. I'm going to go ahead and build one storage unit. And we'll build it right there, I think. Get that done. Who's next for bed? Nails, you're, you get the bed next. Off you go, girl. Excellent. Little noisy with all the work around you, but if that shine bug go, comes too far down, it'll wake him. Wake her. Stay up top. Stay up top. And will you to stay up top? Stay up. Go up. Up. It's working. Yeah. Nice. Worked. Nails is fine. All right. So all this gets uh, dug out, and that drops everything. So we're gonna have two barracks here. So this will be a barrack space, and this will be a barrack space. If I have that the door is going to be there so that and that will be barracks let's put those like super low priority so they don't touch them uh this space is what no hold on a second hold the phone that's too high just two barrack spaces because i want 12 ish duplicates in here by mid game if by if we make it to 100 cycles without me killing them off i'll be gleefully surprised um well, if that's the case, once I've got this layer above done, that can go in. A couple more tiles there, and then we'll do another one. There we go. One more tile above that. Mine it out. Oh, he stops right in the middle of it. Oh, okay. Frankie, it's your turn. It is your turn. No, it's not. It is Nicola's turn. If Frankie needed the bathroom. Okay, Nicola, you have the bed now. Frank, you just needed the bathroom, that's all. Alright, uh, excuses when you're going to clean the bathroom. Just sit there and talk on your cell phone for a while, I see, huh? See how it is, Mr. Dude. Alright, so these now come in here. Excellent, let's do those up right away. Good. Uh, next thing we're going to need is... This is going to be a mess hall, we won't do that yet. And this is going to be our, la our latrine. And then uh, water source down here. Okay. I'll use this to clean up this stuff so we don't have to take care of it down there. It'll make its way down but not into the water. That would be better. Actually. Yeah. No, you know what? Change that. I'm going to put that differently. I, I like the idea of everything gathering semi-central. So let's do that. Nothing left above there that we're going to be digging anytime soon. So we'll go ahead and put this in place next. We can clean that up. And if I just remove those two tiles. So Frankie, is it your turn now, finally? It's your time to shine. Okay, we'll leave that bed one more time. Switch it to Frankie. And everything will be fine. There we go. Good. Alright, let's get this built. We did get this built. Being built. Excellent. So I'm going to set this to be a sweep everything. I'm going to tell everybody they can do tidying at like a very high priority. And then I'm just going to sweep up the junk right here. Just these three tiles. And then the stuff, also the stuff that's on top of the plants. So they'll just haul it all off and throw it in there like super fast. Sorry, Frankie. Sorry, Frankie. Um, do I attack that shine bug or later? Go, go, shine bug. Oh, you hideous thing. All right, let's see what do you have for options. Uh, oxiferns aren't that great. There's better options for oxygen production. A 12 pilot jeepers with increased strength, increased medicine, and narcolepsy. You know what? None of these are great options for us. Animal husbandry and tidying is actually pretty darn good. Ari, animal husbandry and tidying. Clean up crew with early ranching. With buff 
strength. Okay. One narcoleptic. Won't kill us. Alright, and you are going to be on... I guess it really doesn't matter. You can be on the top shift. That's fine. Oh, this shine bug. Sorry, Frankie. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Okay. What we're gonna need to do then is... How much is still left to clean up here? A lot? Alright, let's drop the priority. Standard priority, please. Get that done. Poor Frankie. Listen, if you don't bug off, bug. Schedule-wise, we have Nails and Ari going in next. Alright. Actually, you're in there. Ari and Nails go there. And let's take that and that out. Okay. So that's getting cleaned up. What I can do is just hit all again. Empty and throw it back on the floor. And then they'll just be still ordered to pick up all this stuff. And I just took those out so that we can get the junk off the, the pile, giant pile of junk off the floor. Okay, this is going to work. A little unorthodox start. What else would you expect? There we go. Got that all cleaned out now. Um, Frankie's finishing up that tile. Well, we'll shortly finish up that tile. That's good. What I want to do is immediately go over here. And not that. This. And then we'll put that in and all this in. There we go. And that'll be enough once I put a door in to make that an actual barracks. So let's do that. Scrap on the left on the rest of it on the bottom. Just leave it like that, guys. There we go. We'll have to very rapidly turn that into insulated tiles over there, but that's fine. Ari and Nails should both have a space to sleep. If we can get this all built before the bugs come down and harass us, that would be lovely. Hey, don't worry about the beds, dude. Make the walls, these ones preferably, before he gets there. Yes, yes. Keep it going. Get him out of there. Hey, they woke up. As long as we don't now close him in the bedroom, that's what he's going to do. He's going to run right in there. And then we're going to have him closed in there. Frankie, you'll have this one. A little, a little scared of the door. No, no, no. Up. Up. You, get away, get away. I wish they'd be scared of us. They're not. <laughs> there we go. Looks like we might get it closed in after all. Yes, nice. All right. So that's now categorized as a barracks, and that should keep them nice and happy for a while. Who's not got a bed? Uh, this one is Nicolas. We'll leave the empty one at the corner. Wonderful. Okay. Let's go like that with flooring, because why not? And I'm probably going to need like a ladder there and there eventually. Take that all out of there, and we can bring this down to about there now. With a ladder in the middle. Excellent. Okay, they can share the, the, the one lavatory for now, the one outhouse for now. Not a proper lavatory, but... See, we're getting food supplies. We got 26,000 kilocalories, more than we started with, just from digging out. And hi, Ari, what are you doing? What are you doing, girl? Go to bed. Your bed's right. Oh, really? You missed your entire sleep schedule up there? Oh, you weren't sleeping. Oh, you're a narcoleptic. <laughs> I forgot. That was just you falling asleep for the fun. Just for sport. All right, I want a sweep order right here. Clean up that, please. It's not going to be an interruptingly high level. Actually, priority-wise, you're going to be ranching first priority, but then supplying, tidying, and actually tidying, supplying, ranching, storing, that's good. Maybe you can do a lot of that moving and shaking of stuff before we get around. Ooh, a new egg. Where is it? Come on. Come on, it's there somewhere. Not letting me click it. But it is! It's Shine Bug Egg. Shine Nymph Egg, actually. Okay, look at that. We're digging into the uh, latrine and the mess hall. Wonderful. 
going well. Frankie, is it your uh, your time to have a nap? It is. Go sleep, sir. <clears throat> Lovely. This is working with one toilet. Barely. Because they're kind of off schedule. That's why I think it's working so well right now. Oh, did we lose our again? No, nope. oh, you're fine. All right. Look at that. We're going to do a similar ditty right there. I want to dig that out. First, to drop the stuff. Please. Please to remove the floor. Thank you. Put in a new one. Oh, I didn't need to drop that stuff. That was dumb. <laughs> nice save, scum, and go back. Um... I should have left that because that was the whole point of piling. I want some stuff piled here, some stuff piled here, and then later we'll have some like piled there. That way they're not, it's not all at the bottom and it's kind of centralized. They can actually get to it. Open and close. So it's all jumped in a pile there. So if they need to build something or pick up some seeds or whatever, they can come to a reasonable spot. That was a short little uh, nap there, are you? Good job. Is that because you were getting up to go to your schedule? Of course you were. Ha <laughs> you little twit. <laughs> Love it. Okay, so that'll get cleared out, and then this, then we're gonna start with the latrine down here. Um, that's fine. We'll let that all go to the bottom, like we did with that one, and we'll just, well, I'll just do a hyper sweep rate. Oops. Let's say that one, not yet. That can be the current urgent drop off. You're about halfway done. Good. Colony achievements, duplicate temperature. We're going to get science going here too as well. I should say once we get once we get this cleared out, we're almost there. These red are indicating that there's somebody lacking in hard digging. We're lacking a hard digging skill, which is fine. We'll get there. Uh, if you make that rooftop first, then I can just cancel the ladder under your feet, friend. I'm okay with this, Nails. You can dig under yourself and drop yourself two floors. Okay, less than ideal. But all right, make that ladder a thing. All right, so this is, uh, that's full up again. See how much stuff they got there, it's just nuts. Oh, come on, I just keep, every time there's somebody in the way, every time I click on it, there you go. Drop it on the floor, pick it up again. They won't pick up what's on the floor. There's zone, because it's on sweep only, they'll only pick up stuff that I specifically give orders for. So that's okay. Nails is going uh, hog on the digging in the basement. Nicola coming to, to cheer her on, to get lots done. Ari and Frankie are nearly finished the obnoxious, silly dig side wood. I like it clean, so do the dupes. They like it tidy. Look at that. Ah, this is where the, look at that, look at that gas. It's just starting to build up there now. This is where the, somewhere over there is the natural gas geyser, and somewhere up here-ish is the cold biome. Well, this is all fairly, no, this is all fairly cold. It's like a weird twist of cold and hot kind of mixed through there. It's odd. Ah, there we go. That's one of our fancy buildings. This is the supply teleporter output. So this comes back to us from the other, um, from the other second, I guess it could be called the second asteroid, where we can teleport to. I don't see the other units. I don't remember where they were in my test. Oh, there we go. This is, no, this is the Sending a, a duplicate, the transmitter. So the other one must be just right below it, the receiver. Little arrows between, look, <laughs> going between asteroids. So you send them in there and they teleport to a specific, not just anywhere, but to one asteroid there and back. Oh, everybody's just standing around now. Look at that. Already got them <clears throat> bored. All right, so that cleanup is done. We'll shut that guy off. Set this one up. Uh, all in sweep. Give the sweep order right there excellent okay once that's done we can take those ladders out this dig can be done once we get skills and the next thing then is going to be to build out the rooms and each room can be uh, you know what hold on that and that we'll have to actually dig that stuff out oops this is going to be the latrine, so we're actually going to put some stuff down here for uh, cleaning purposes, for, for oxygen purposes. Uh-oh. Hurry up. That's the only one we have. Uh, so we're going to fix that. One, two, three, and four, and then we'll put in, we'll put in four of those, and then 
four wash basins. Just, I could put the double uh, doors, but this way if I put these in, I can just print over with the airflow tiles, which I prefer the look of later. This will need to have a door down here, that'll need to have a door, that'll need to have a door, and eventually that will have a door as well. There's actually some... Oh, What's this? Ah! Thimble Reed! Okay, so we can get our as, uh, Asmos suits, our Atmos suits, our Exo Atmos suits for with that stuff and the mushrooms dust cap those are, are farmables all right let's dig this out as well all right let's go a high priority dig to get some of this metals uh what just cleared is there an auto save or something uh and that is fine this is what some na na nasty gas carbon dioxide polluted oxygen nothing we can't handle so let's do that as well uh, you know what? Actually, that's probably a little premature. Let's not dig that out. Let's uh, dig this out. Just the stuff that we don't, that's usable. Don't need the abyss light, but then we'll get access to all this food stuffs. There we go. Who's sleeping? Nicola's turn. Good. Look at you, beast. Nails, you're crazy. See, that's why I left these open, because they'll drop the stuff from there down to the basement. Uh, that's pretty good. We got the bathrooms already in. They're so quick. You're beautiful people. Uh, so I'm going to set it so that they, uh, when they pass from the left to the right, that they forcibly use the bathroom. Uh, we're going to go ahead and get down to the water then now. Um, it's pretty good. It's way late to be doing that, but a pitcher pump down here is probably good. Do that. That we can uh, dig out a little here, maybe a little over here. You know what? All this can go except for, say, we'll leave that level. Good. We can pick stuff up. All that also has to go. Good. Because we'll put another floor down here. Actually, let's go one tile even more. So, I'll, no, you know what? I'll leave the stuff on the. Cancel. I'll leave the stuff because that's this is going to be the main the bottom floor for the foreseeable future. Probably not super long, but eventually I'll you know I'll, I'll eventually change it. But uh, let's get that out of there. It's fine. And that's in there. Okay. Good. So they'll pull this out. It'll destroy those two plants. That's fine. Also, might as well take that one out of there. Okay. Going good. Yeah. There's the there it is. Natural gas geyser. So hopefully in Five to ten cycles, we can get that up. Hello, Paku fish. Nice. I like Paku fish. Domesticated, they pump up the food. Oh, another, another thimble reed and some diluted oxygen and carbon dioxide. Oh, he's he's a he's a venting. Oh, is it is it overpressurized? No. Okay, it's just sitting idle, waiting for it to build up again. High pressure geyser that periodically erupts with hot natural gas. So 150 Celsius, not unbearably hot. Uh, 202 seconds every 443, so almost half the time it's erupting. Well, it's not dormant, so we'll find out. We'll find out about the dormant cycle later. New printables available. Cycle six already, guys. That's amazing. Uh, we can get brine or a bunch of dirt or a digger tidier morning happy, decrease construction and decrease germs. Um, I'm just gonna take the dirt actually. Don't need to push things, don't need to rush them. Like that there, and we'll make all these priority nine just so that they always upkeep those beautiful things when we instruct them to. I'm gonna make a ladder down to the bottom there. Lots of room here for uh, access to. I'll wait, I'll wait for that floor to get put in. There we go. Um, okay, we got those there. Uh, also didn't need that there. Oops. Alright, so the flooring's in and a drowning hatch. Oh, poor little hatch. I don't think I can help you. You're not going to be able to ladder your way up there. You're just going to drown. Poor little guy. Oh well. Dinner's on the meat's back on the menu. Uh, speaking of which, how's our menu? 
29,000 kilocalories, mostly muck root that we found out and about. A little bit of nutrient bars left and some and a tiny speck of meal lice that's uneaten. Okay. Well, they took, apparently I took out all the plants, so there's not much point in... Um, I guess we can take that out as well. It has no lumens. No lux. Uh, also has no lux. Okay, uh, we have some people with skills. Yay, everybody's got skills ready. Okay, uh, Ari's passion is in ranching. We're going to start her out with farming to get oh, unlock the ranching, and she can do the farming. We got our lovely researcher Frankie, Nails with the building, and Niccolo with the hard digging. Now, now that he's got the hard digging, he should be able to chew all that up. See, it's no longer red. That's excellent. Lovely, lovely. Okay, this can go off. This one up here can go on. Dig it all up, clean it all up. Good. I'm gonna leave all that stuff. It can be dealt with later. It's long. It's out of their living space. Uh, we're gonna put the research in here. Some oxygen production down here. It's pretty good. A couple more um, outhouses here should do. There we go. And now put a floor in there. Lovely. Clean this up at some point. A little bit of disinfecting going on. Overly disinfecting going on, but whatever. It's working for them. It's keeping them entertained. Uh, this can actually go away. We don't need it anymore. Alright, so space for research. Um, I think what we'll do is... We will temporarily put our power stuff here. So what I'll do is... I'll leave three spaces because later I want to put the better research bench there. That can go there, this can go here, and the research station can go here. Uh, this thing provides light, and if they're working there in light, or with these, um, they'll get a, a working in light bonus, so that'll be good. Let's put a little bit of power under the flooring here, and then perhaps, speaking of which, let's put some floors in. There. I'm going to throw that all the way across. And actually, we can just go crazy there. That'll eventually be a something. I don't know what. Uh, down here, we're gonna oh, we're gonna make some farming in here. I think I don't want to cut into the water yet. We'll put farming or first like temporary farming in here, just regular like mealwood, or whatever, in along here, and then we can start the water basin in this level. And I think we'll put like. Either down here, or maybe the, we'll have a conduit here for, like, utility something between for pipes and stuff between the two water things. Maybe some filtering and such uh, in this one. And then we'll put the polluted water. We'll bring it all up into sort of a chamber up there. But this will be used first. So we'll get rid of all that stuff. Um, we can't actually access that, can we? We'll get there and there. That'll be pretty good. That'll be more than enough uh, space to get you guys very happily occupied. Now, this is all in now. Let's go ahead and start our first research. So, first things first. Um, I'm going to actually go straight to the research. Just so we can set those new research facilities up first. And then... And then I'll put a bigger power... Nah, you know what? I'm not sure. This one's... Decent on the heat. No, it emits. It wastes a lot of heat. 1.25 and a thousand joules of leakage. Hmm. How about the other re the other battery pack? Doesn't show me. Okay. Hi, friendly lightning bug. Gotta play it safe around electricity. Got. Uh, do we have some meat down there? We did end up with some meat down there. It's 86% fresh, huh? Well, I don't think we're going to be able to cook it at all anytime soon. So hopefully somebody will go eat it. Uh, I want all edibles in here for now. Had a priority nine. Did I have that set? Good, I do. Diggy diggy hole. Everybody's doing the job. See, as they pass from left to right, if they get germs, which some of them do, they will... Oh, that is a lot of germs. What do I have in there that is causing the germs? Is something actually... Yeah, polluted dirt. Okay, let's not have that there. Instead, let's make 
Uh, make one down here uh, in the water. Okay, we'll put that one in tack nails. Thank you. Good job, girl. So this one can be our uh, polluted dirt and other things that are going to cause problems. We have no... What's it called? That makes the chlorine. I don't remember. Uh, does this one have... No, this one has nothing. Right? Okay, so this is actually going to be set with polluted dirt. It's going to be set to priority 9 and not to sweep only. So it'll grab any of that. Later when we get some, if we find slime, like I saw some over here, that's why we stopped digging. This is slime. I don't want to open that up because that'll emit a lot of yuck bugs into the air. Right now we are pretty bug free. I would like you to actively disinfect those buildings, please. Uh, more research. Let's set the priority up on that. And, oh, oh, I just told him to do something. Uh, oh, I actually did click that. I did not mean to. I meant to leave him on the research. But there we go. We got the big battery. Maybe we'll look at it now. By accident. So this one has a thousand. It's got the same heat. This one wastes twice as much power, but contains four times as much. Okay. I'm all right with that. We'll put it over here, because... Uh, we'll need the space for it, and this can come over like that. I'll need that later. And the power line up there. Good. Good, good, good. Oh, look at the little shine nymph. That's a baby shine bug. Oh yeah, we're still dealing with issues here. What else is in here? Algae's not doing it. The eggshells aren't doing it. So it's just somebody needing to do... Oh, what is that order? What would be a job for this? Aaron's... Store material for storing skill. Okay, so that's the issue. Storing isn't top priority. We'll just let her urgently do that now. There you go. A polluted dirt picked up. Nice. Dropped. Is there more? Nope. Polluted dirt. Good. And disinfected. I do not want this thing. Uh, I don't think it can emit germs into the water. What is that? Oh, it's slime. That is a lot of slime lung. I don't want... Oh, look at that. Somebody just carried all that food poisoning. So, you notice the numbers. 1,500, 1,490, 1,480, 70. So, as long as they're not grabbing a bunch of it and keep making it worse, you don't want to disable disinfect. I actually legitimately want you to disinfect what's in here that's causing that. Maybe there's something bad. Um, I don't think any of these have of germs, do they? Muckroot has food poisoning. Okay. Muckroot is germy. I did not realize that. Well, I guess we gotta get some farming going sooner rather than later than I guess, huh? I guess, I guess. Alright. Uh, we'll shut that off for now. Not all. Off. We get these done. Excellent. Alright, let's see. How are we doing on time? We're getting close to the end here, so let's... uh. Let's uh, plan out tomorrow's uh, line of attack. Um, what I'd like to do is get these rooms all set up. So a second barracks, don't really need it. This thing needs its uh, sign to be a proper park slash nature reserve. Put in a mess hall here, get this thing finished up, and get a proper bit of research. That's already having a nap. That's fine. Narcoleptic naps are wonderful. Um, or Ari. <laughs> or maybe not. Maybe she just gets more sleep. Uh, and we want to really keep an eye on this germ issue. If that's going to cause food poisoning frequently, then eh, not great. Not great. I think it's just the muckroot. Once we stop depending on muckroot, we should be okay. All right. And those in there. That should close everything off. Finish the sweep up in that corner. And clean up the diggy mess here. Okay. Let's go prioritize this into uh, a now thing. The whole section. Good stuff. What, what is the red for? Oh, no storage available? Oh, I've got them shut off. That's fine. Okay. Oh, I did it again. Yes, I don't like the idea that that's not a thing. That's fine. I don't need the critter... I do... I don't really need the critter eggs either. Let's not put them. Good. Okay. Well, that's it for today. Thank you, everybody. If you do enjoy uh, the content, please uh, let me know in the comments and or hitting the like button. Uh, and please do tune in tomorrow. We'll be doing these about 45 minutes. Ow. I punched my desk. 
Ow, that hurt. Uh, we'll be doing about 45 minutes worth of adventure while I bleed. Uh, um, it, it, we'll be doing about a 45 minute episodes and uh, hopefully we'll have some, uh, uh, some good fun together. Maybe we'll make it all the way to cycle 100 without killing off the dupes. Maybe we'll make it to another asteroid. That'd be great. Stick with us for the story. Uh, our little crew is uh, making themselves at home on this new asteroid. And uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. I really am looking forward to exploring a lot of the of the stuff that we have in this new uh, new DLC, the Abyssalite. Very very small asteroids. I think if we pan over, that's the edge of the map there, and that's the edge of the map there. So they're tiny asteroids compared to the old. Or that's just maybe that's just as far as I can look right now. But I think that's it. Uh, and uh, so there's lots and lots of new content requiring you to go a lot of places. Harness some of the wild. It's pretty good. I'm looking forward to this. If you guys do want uh, to join us again, hit the subscribe and join the channel. Uh, if you're uh, new and you haven't seen our stuff before, thanks so much for joining us, and I hope you enjoy. We'll see you in the game.